Health officials will be keeping an eye out this weekend as they emphasize the problems associated with gatherings, everything from parties to the beach. WBZ's Jim Smith has more on this tonight. Labor Day weekend is finally here, and Revere is one of the COVID hotspots the governor and others are worried about. So is the message getting out here at the beach. A picture-perfect sunset at Revere Beach, almost enough to make you forget about the pandemic. But the signs are everywhere, warnings to take precautions. Many visitors are complying, and at dusk, it's easier to be socially distant. I think everybody was prepared for the weekend in terms of trying to do the best social distancing, but it's still a challenge. You know, the weather is perfect, but we need to stay vigilant and try to do exactly what we're being asked to do. Earlier Saturday, Revere Beach was much more crowded. Traffic signs, driving home safety advisories. A guy who's been coming here for decades says masks and common sense must prevail. They should be staying apart, but it's very hard to do when you have a group of people. Now, I don't have my mask on right here because I'm, I'm right here by myself. I do have my mask in my pocket, so if I do take a walk, I'll put it on. Summer is fading now during a year unlike any other. It's hard to say when the old ways will come back, if ever. But like many, a visitor from New Jersey is still able to enjoy the day. I really feel safe here, and I feel like people really have the conscience to wear masks whenever you know they're you know have to standing within the six feet. You know, in general, I feel really good and safe here. Summer's last holiday weekend isn't even half over yet, and the warnings will continue through Monday. At Revere Beach, Jim Smith, WBZ News.